Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi taala wabarakatuh. You're with me Fatima in another series of Tea Talk. And I know I'm not in my usual place. I'm in a very different setting. This is actually me in Pahang. And uh, I'm here with my um my father and mother visiting my wonderful grandmother here in Pahang. And uh, yes, it is still in Ramadan month if you are wondering. I want to do this video to talk about why we should appreciate what we have now. Okay? There's a lot of things that we need to appreciate in this world. Be it a moment or a person or a situation, you really need to take your time to really appreciate all of them because first and foremost, why you need to appreciate things like this because you don't even know in the future if you have the possibility to, you know, kind of like come across the time for you to be together again. What I'm, what I'm trying to say to all of you is you do not know in the future you will still be able to, you know, get the chance to kind of like meet that person, see that person or meet the situation, you know, get the things that you will have like right now. You know, still having the, you know, leisure of having things that you have right now. So that is, you know, the sole reason for you to really appreciate what you have here, right now. Like, right at this moment in your life. The basic way for you to really appreciate things is to be present at that very moment. When you are with someone, wherever you are. You know, nowadays technology is always distract uh, us all from, you know, communicating with each other like face to face. So if you have a person, you know, in front of you, you know, talk to them rather than, you know, spending your time with a phone or your electronic device right nowadays. I'm doing it now because I want to talk to all of you about this. What makes me think about this is, you know, um... I'm here visiting my grandma. I am very, I am very grateful that I'm, st- I am here still able to see her. I wonder what happened to me if, you know, the next thing I know that I won't be able to see her anymore. So that makes me think, like, I should appreciate. And the way for me to appreciate, there's a lot of way for you to appreciate. Okay. Not like only giving gifts or, you know, like visiting every once in a while will do. You can do that. It will still be part of, you know, appreciating. But really, you really need to appreciate them. The moment people, things in your life, in your heart, starting from your heart. I mean, you really need to be there when they really need you. Or when they need you, not like really, really need you. When they need you, you be there. The whole body and soul there, okay? So this is more to human being. For things, right? If you have like good house, you have a nice car, you have, you know, plenty of food to eat. You might as well be very thankful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, to God that you, you know, be able to be in that situation where you have no problem getting it. You know, for some people, don't even have that opportunity of getting it anywhere near their life. So, when you have things lying, like, beside you, or, you know, there, kind of, like, just be there, make sure you always bear in mind that things like that will you know, one day vanish from your life. And when that time comes, are you prepared for it? Are you okay? If you're positive enough that you are okay, then go ahead. Don't appreciate stuff. Because most of us, this is common. When things are in front of our eyes, we are, you know, we never appreciate them. We never know that it really exists in front of you. But when things starting, you know, not existing in front of you, then you would be so stressed up, devastated, 
feel very sad because you won't get to see that thing or that person or that moment again. So, in this nonsense of this video, I just want to say to all of you, even the smallest thing in your life, right, you think that it won't affect you when it's gone, it really will definitely affect you. Because what's been lying like around you, your surrounding now, really what, this is what I think, really kind of like build you, become you. So when even the smallest thing like gone missing, you are not you as a whole anymore. So at the end of the day, you will definitely say that I I did not appreciate that thing. I did not appreciate that person. I did not appreciate this mom that moment, that particular moment. Then I am very sad right now. So I don't want all of you to do that. So let, let us keep reminding each other to appreciate stuff. It's very important because as a human being, we have memories. Yes, of course we have memories, but it's good to have good memories rather than bad memories about something, someone, somewhere. Okay? So... Appreciating is to really be there, you know, really be present at that certain moment, that certain um, surrounding or really use something for its use. I mean, don't put it around like you don't really need it, the, you know, until the day that you really lose it, then you regret everything. I don't want all of you to regret because that's my kind of like, Principle in life. This is a uh, my principle that I I will definitely don't want to regret anything in this world. So I hope that you guys have the same mindset. You know, regretting something. Yes, you will definitely learn something out of it. But regretting it is not a good feeling. Trust me. Okay. So to avoid uh, regretting things, right? Start appreciating your time. Start appreciating people around you, your family member, your friends, whoever cross your path. Start appreciating your surroundings. Start appreciating what you have to eat. Start appreciating, you know, the condition that you are in. Start appreciating the very country you're living in. I know there's a lot of things going on in your country that I might not know. But, you know what, at least you're still alive, living in this world. You still have clothes to wear. You have things to carry yourself for a good living so appreciating it is really will make you feel better living in this world you know for all muslims or not muslim non-muslim or muslim out there remember you've been created in this world for a reason and things enough that's why I become like that. Think only how some pat kunci lagi. This is very funny. How to open this? Jadi nak buka di bawah. Ah kambing. Jahat kambing. Kambing ah sondol mi ah at the back. Oh kambing. So scary. Yeah, I don't know. I I may be putting this in my footage because this is funny. Hi kambing. There's a lot of kambing. <laughs> Apparently, they di they don't really like me. Kind of like recording in the staircase over there, but it's very fun. This is my very experience being chased by this bunch of group. <laughs> this is great. I like this. So appreciate stuff, okay? Appreciate your time. Appreciate what you have in this world. Appreciate all the things that. <laughs> oh my God! This is really really scary. <laughs> Appreciate every single thing that you have in life. Even your lifetime right now is very funny, but yes, but <laughs> okay, so stay healthy, stay being yourself. Try your best not to get chased by you know groups of sheep. 
um, be very <laughs> grateful of your life. Thank you, Allah, that you let me survive this. Uh, I don't know what will happen to me. Okay, that's it. Bye. Assalamualaikum. Uh, I promise you nonsense.